Hello everyone, this is Anachrome of the New England StarCraft II League coming at you with a micro tactic in which I'm calling concave blinking. Now, as most people tend to do, they tend to set up their stalkers in a concave so that they can all get into the fight, take less flash damage, so on, so on, so forth. However, the problem's always been that when you try to advance your army and blink, they all start this little bunch up thing and then you have to go back to square one or you end up losing some fight time because your because your units aren't properly positioned. Now, what I'm calling concave blinking is when you blink using the mini-map in the direction in which you want to go. Uh, I kind of discovered this by accident, so I'll give a quick example of it. Um, if you are to initiate a blink, and instead of clicking to where you want to go, you use the mini-map, on the far reaches of, the, of the, uh, the map you're currently playing on, your units will retain the concave. So if I was to blink down, I would just click the bottom of the mini-map, and you'll notice that all the units have retained their structure and still more or less are in their concave. Now, I mean, one, I think this looks pretty cool, and it may not have too many implications in battle, but at the same time, I mean, something's better than nothing. So what I'm going to do here is quick, give a quick example. I'm going to siege up these tanks here. All right. And I'm actually going to advance on in, and uh, I'm going to initiate an attack move, and then blink into the army like someone would normally do to clear out a siege line. Now, of course, this is just a unit example. I don't have uh, stalker. Um, I have stalkers, but I don't have zealots or marines on the other side. But this is just a basic example of how this tactic may or may not be useful. So I'm just going to go ahead and initiate attack move here, and then do the blink in. Now you notice that my units have maintained the concave as they engage, and uh, the siege line is taking an awful lot of damage, and I'm pretty sure I'm going to end up winning this battle. Now, so as you can see that this method does have some practical uses, um, and whether you're trying to uh, you know, zone out a certain portion of the map, you need to move your stalkers, but you don't want them to lose their formation. Um, there's a lot of different ways you can use this tactic. Now, uh, what I'm going to do here is just kind of restock up and make the same amount that I had before with a normal Blinken, just to show that this does actually help your cause. So I'm going to make the 8 tanks and the 16 stalkers again, and you'll see that the outcome of the battle is an awful lot different with a normal Blinken. This will only take a second. So we'll just try this one more time. So I got my 16 stalkers. And let's group up these 8 siege tanks again. Oop, that's only 7. Let's make one more. There we go. Alright, so I'll, I'll... I'll even concave them again. But I'll blink I'll blinks, uh, a more standard way, and you folks can see the uh, the difference in the outcome of the battle. I believe the last time I tried this, there were three siege tanks still alive. So, I'll even start a concave and just normally blink onto the army. Alright, let's try this one more time. So, got my army highlighted, I'm going to attack move in, and then blink. Now, even with some shoot and scoot micro, my stalkers are dying awfully quick. Um, like I said, this is not a fight you would normally be able to win with a standard blink. So, uh, yeah, pretty much same outcome. You got three siege tanks still alive, so the concave blinking does improve in this situation. Um, basically, this is a basic example of how you can um, apply this tactic and uh, hopefully get it to work for you. Um, I've I've checked a few forums. I've um, ma mainly uh, teamliquid.net. Uh, great site. If you haven't heard of it, go check it out. And uh, I've also been on YouTube looking for a similar tutorial. And I didn't find one, which is the only reason why I'm making this video today. Uh, but basically, that's a rundown of the tactic. Um, 
my name's Anachromy, it's called concave blinking. So if it's called something else before and I didn't know, but that's what I'm calling it, so I might as well stick with it. Uh, hope this helps out your game a little bit in some way. If not, you know, something cool to impress your friends. Uh, this is Anachromy, signing out. Have a good night.